I stop sure. reading. Yeah, comic books come out each week. Uh, we sell them and read them, so we give you our picks for the best comic books. And we talk about most of what we read. Yeah. Not all of what we read, but most of it. So, I'm going to be honest, this was not my pick of the week until I read it, but it was one of the last things I read this it's week. It's usually how books work. Um... Uh, so I'll tell you, do you well, often have book picks of the week before you read the book? Uh, sometimes. Sometimes, I'm sure. I'm sure <laughs> I've picked them out. I wasn't sure. Here's the deal. If there's a book that I get really excited about, let's be honest, half the time it, it doesn't meet expectations. And uh, I was kind of thinking... I feel that when you're really excited about a book, it doesn't meet expectations. I was kind of thinking that uh, Conan, although I was super excited about I was kind of worried it was not going to meet expectations. And it did. Uh, Conan the Barbarian, number one. Marvel took it back over. Jason Aaron's writing it. Um, it was just very classic Conan the Barbarian. Write down the one scene I always remember with, with the old like Schwarzenegger movies mm -hmm. is at the very end, they would always go back to him sitting on the throne uh, because, you know, King Conan is kind of where Conan eventually ends. And so, uh, as this comic started, you started with the birth of Conan, and then you immediately jumped ahead to, like, old man Conan sitting on the throne, and then they kind of jumped earlier and told the story to get to where we were, we're going with it. It just um, sounds weird when you say Conan sitting on the throne. <laughs> 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 Not what I'm picturing. Anyway, I, I opened that up for you, Bobby. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, every once in a while. So oh, gosh. Yeah. Anyway, so... Um, but yeah, so I, I was I was geeked from the very you know second panel there. Uh, I knew it was heading in a good spot. Uh, it's classic kind of sword and sorcery stuff. It's what you expect going in the barbarian to fight. He's in the pits fighting. Then he's fighting a witch. Then he's fighting like zombie skeletons. Um, and uh, so it kind of headed off. Had a great twist at the end. Uh, then it followed it up. It has like the first five pages of a Conan novella that mm -hmm. has never been published before. So you got to read even more Conan the Barbarian. But have you read the Robert E. Howard stuff, like the original Conan? I and all? think I read one or two. I'm not sure. I've a long time ago. Yeah, we're, we're talking like high school, Tim. But yeah, back when we read book books. Back when I read book books. But yeah, that's, so that's why I was excited to get that because I was like, oh cool, it's Conan. And so it, this book was really good. Yeah, like, it was. Uh, I was surprised. Like Jason Aaron um, had that tweet, and I've like been. I wasn't excited before that tweet, but when he tweeted out just the picture of all the old Robert E. Howard books, like he just had this massive yeah. pile of them, and he's like, "Y'all saying I'm not the right guy to write count?" And it was just one of those was like, "Boom!" Like <laughs> I was like, "Okay, that's cool that you're front like that. That's amazing." And then I. Uh, and Jason Aaron's always so hit and miss, you know, and... I think he's, he is mostly hit, his miss has all been Avengers, which Avengers oh, yeah. is one of those, like, books by committee. Um, and this book was, it was, the only thing that I could maybe say for it is, like, uh, I expected to laugh a little more throughout, just because Conan is so absurd, and I expected, like, absurd action kind of dribble then the only like funny moment came from the came from the witch after that turn yeah um when she like shinings him and then afterwards she's like is this the release you were expecting you know like that part i think was... classically you don't get a ton of laughs from it though i mean even the movies were no, but he meant says, to be more serious he than says like word. cool dude stuff Sometimes, like i expected yeah. more cool dude stuff like every time there's set up for cool dude like action lines yeah. throughout this whole thing and like i don't that's the only it's it's a small critique in a book that's yeah. like otherwise kind of perfect um because it's it's just it's a conan ass conan book and i was a little worried when marvel was doing it and it's disney now and i was like you know it's like conan's gotta fuck like is that gonna happen and, and it, it, does. Did. it does there's a lot of that uh going he, on here so he hops in bed with the witch yeah doesn't know she's a witch See, i forgot no. about this coming out and i didn't grab it because we had that weird thing of like yeah get to grab books like a week and a half <laughs> and I forgot and I'm going to take it home and I hate to check I, it out. You'll, you'll actually really, I was really so excited. enjoy it. Yeah. I'm really excited about Marvel having it now. So they've got the other Conan book coming out and then they've got another book coming out in the universe that they've, they've kind of advertised at the They're end of it. Taught, what I'm hearing is like we're going to get Conan integrated in with like 
the Avengers and stuff like that is what the like long yeah. play is of this. And I don't know how I feel about that. I don't really like that, but again, I guess I'll see how it goes. Um, I'll, I'll see where they take it. Might be one of those but, weird things that just works, though. You know, I mean. But it's like, he just feels like another Thor. <laughs> so I don't. Or like, Hercules, when you get Hercules integrated in. So yeah, it's, occasionally. Well, it's like, I don't know if we need Thor and Conan operate, like, breathing the same air. Like, that's a yeah. little samey for me, but, you know. But no, it, this, if it's a Conan book, but it is, I felt very close to a perfect Conan book. And, uh, yeah. yeah, it was definitely, I, uh, I was leaning towards something else, and I read that, and I was like, oh, this just hands down is the, is the pick this week. So I truly... Truly loved it. I'm excited. I guess it's going to be every two weeks at least for the time being. So, because yep. that's what Marvel does to